Welcome to a dramatic reading of an anime post from 20 years ago this week. And this has to do with Princess Mononoke, which had come out uh, about a year ago, I believe, in Japan. And there was uh, a lot of Oscar buzz around Princess Mononoke, um, Hayao Miyazaki's arguably greatest film. And the thing is, um, it did not get an Oscar nomination. And this was considered a bit of an issue, and there's a lot of discussion about this, and a thread about this sort of Oscar snub of Princess Mononoke. Now, this is way, you know, I mean, most folks did not know what anime was in America, so the chances of anything anime getting any sort of Oscar, you know, attention was very unlikely, but, you know, it was possible. So, um, that did not stop people from talking about it. And so we do have a little conversation here from somebody named Julius in a thread called Mononoke Hime Dist Otaku Threatened to Riot. Personally, I prefer it to stay underground. Not to mention the fact that in our society, it has to be a movie to get an Academy Award. Right? The only way an animated movie can be nominated for an Academy Award is if it were made by Black Disney. Just goes to show that it doesn't take much to keep a group of insipid, brain-dead people entertained. Why don't they try to watch something original instead of a pounded-out remake of a story that's been heard a million times over? Next thing, Disney is going to rip off Miyazaki. Just like Osamu Tezuka's Jungle Emp. Jungle Emperor Leo. Oh wait, I forgot. They bought the rights to all of his stuff. You know, I personally think they did this so it won't be seen in the US. Mainly because they don't want people to see how much their stuff sucks. Uh-huh. And as we all know, you know, Disney made sure that no one watched Hayao Miyazaki movies ever again. 